Let's take a look at how we can use Photo Director 5 to turn photographs from this to this, or this to an evening shot, or this sunset to something more dramatic. We can do this by using either global adjustment tools or regional adjustment tools. Let's look at the global adjustment tools. There are eight of them and anything we do is reflected across the whole of the image. We can play with the color temperature here, increasing it a little bit to make it a bit more sunny, and you can see the effect across the entire image. Let's look at applying a little bit of HDR, making it more dramatic, more like a poster. We can adjust strength and radius, and we can turn them on and off so we don't have to do anything too dramatic all the time. Once we've done that, we have a more dramatic, warmer image. If we want to do something more subtle, we can use the regional adjustment tools. This allows us to manipulate only parts of the image. So let's start with a new image and try to turn it from a winter theme to an autumn theme. To use the regional adjustment tool, I'm going to select my brush and I'm going to select the mask. I start and select my brush size. Let's go with 14. This allows me to paint the area that I want to manipulate. I can turn on my before and after so we can see the effect and my cursor changes to be the pen. I carefully draw around the area that I want to manipulate. Once I've done that, I can see that the mask is color coded in red. So anything I do will just be in that selected portion. You can see it in the magnified view with the exact edge that Photo Director 5 has given us. We can adjust it by feathering or by adjusting the size. Now you can see that any changes I make are only being applied to that section. I'm warming the mountain up a little bit. And as we move further down the selection, we may want to put a little more detail in to make it stand out so we can adjust some of the parameters here. When I'm done with that, if I want to warm up the rest of the image, I can use a different mask. In this case, a gradient mask. And we apply that by dragging downwards. The red signifies the gradient. Again, I can choose to enhance the color temperature, and that's the gradient from the top to the bottom. It warms up the rest of the image. So what we have so far is okay, but there's still a problem. The reflection in the water is still quite white. So let's use a new mask, but this time let's go from the bottom to the top and just warm it up with the color temperature again, just a fraction to give the image a bit more realism in the reflection. That's basically all we really need to do, but now just for fun, maybe we can put a third mask in, running from right to left, and this will allow us to put a little sunlight coming from the right hand side. So we go down to brightness, but not too much, just a little bit is all you need for these subtle effects. So by using these two tools, we went from this to this, a completely different image, and that's Photo Director 5.